I know is real. Who is he? One of the originals. He's a legend. From the first generation of vampires. See, growing up in New Orleans, kids, we, we hear stories about the evil Klaus Michelson. Klaus Michelson, the great evil. I have a nobleman named Klaus. I was taken with him at first, until I found out what he was, and what he wanted from me. I've never even met anyone who's laid eyes on him. I mean, we're talking centuries of truth mixed with fiction. I know what you are, half vampire, half beast. You're the hybrid. A big, bad wolf. If you want something, that's it. If you're not afraid of Klaus, then you're an idiot. May I introduce to you the Lord Niklaus? You're the hybrid. You've heard of me. Fantastic. You are Klaus Michael. You are the most ruthless, wicked beast to ever live. Your life's a living hell. You tormented me. No, 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 Mama. Just to get back at me for running. Whatever you do to escape Klaus, he will get his vengeance. On your friends, your family, on anyone that you've ever loved. I'm gonna kill every last one of them. And then what? Then you return to Mystic Falls to resume your life as the hated one, as the evil hybrid? It is so important to you that people quake with fear at the sound of your name. People quake with fear because I have the power to make them afraid. And you are a cruel, wretched thing. Fed my way through thousands of innocents. And I'm worthy of anyone's love. Little mine. I haven't cared about anything for centuries. You long for nothing, care for no one. Love is a vampire's greatest weakness. What? And we are not. When blood relations let me down, I don't stop to reason with them. I remove them. We manipulate. We thirst for power. We control. We punish. But our actions are driven by one singular place deep inside. And down to Make him suffer on my job! Family. Makes you weak. We're alone. And we hate it. I am Klaus Michelson! I don't need anyone, nor will I be warned by lesser men. I am the thing that lesser men fear. Tremble at the mere mention of your name, but I know you for what you truly are. A little boy. Desperate for a daddy. Viscerate this Stefan fellow like you did Alexander. Or did you simply toss him from a balcony like the unfortunate man? If she who gave you life could come to loathe you and then be snuffed out by your own hand, then what hope is there for you? Then I am vicious and hateful. Your cruelty made sure of that. I sought to protect you. You ruined me. You set my course! Perhaps I should direct my rage toward you. You should see yourself. A murderous expression. A self-righteous posturing. But by hunting Rebecca and Marcel down to the ends of the earth, by terrorizing them the way you yourself were terrorized. You look like father. Don't become your father. That your secret betrayal was the cause of everything I became. I sought the approval I was denied by the man I thought was my father. You turned me into the weakling he hated. You were never the recipient of his cruelty. None of you were. Not Cole, not Finn, none of you. My father lived. Remember me. It is not my intention to become him. No, him. In your paranoid mind, nobody can be trusted. Where does it end? There is no end! Betrayal. I knew it would be difficult to win your trust, Niklaus. It is in your nature, boy. Your reputation precedes you. I don't trust anyone. Because you're too scared to trust. Need I remind you I killed my own father in order to protect her? I am scared of nothing. You know, you all seem to think this is a democracy. I assure you it is not. You're still scared of him. Think you can subdue me? With this, I'm the hybrid. I shall be killed. I am immortal. Will hunt all of you to your end. I'm gonna hunt down everyone you know and everyone you love. <laughs> Always be the daughter of Klaus Michelson, the hybrid killer with a thousand enemies. Beat your makeup. Loneliness. That's why you and I memorialize our dead. There's the briefest of moments before we kill where we literally hold their life in our hands. And then we rip it away. You are the author of everything I am. But in the end, we're left infinitely. Utterly alone. The deeds of the mighty Klaus 
will be remembered by no one. You will remember me. My survival will haunt you through eternity. Klaus Michelson! Your maker. You will never destroy me! And every one of you ever speak of this. I alone have always stood by you. That's why you killed him. Or is it just that you are so terrified of letting someone, anyone, in? Please, just so someone, anyone, would see who you really are, and now that I have, it scares the hell out of you, doesn't and it? you will live out your endless days unloved and alone. You can live forever with no one at your side. And I need them to fear me. Leaving me alone for all time. Is that what this is about? It's supposed to fear you too. Just don't want to be alone. It would be better for you if you did. For you to believe I am the monster they would paint me as. This is what we swore to one another a thousand years ago before life tore away what little humanity you had left. Before ego, before anger, before paranoia created in this person before me. Someone I can barely even recognize as my own brother. And our father hunted him. Hunted us. For centuries, every time we found a moment of happiness, we were forced to flee. Even here, in New Orleans. But we were I thought we'd found a home here. Not long after Nikos broke the spell which prevented him from becoming the hybrid. He defeated our father. I thought this would make him happy. He was angrier than ever. This town was my home once. A home? This this is a war zone. All of this. This is the world that you created, Nikos. What has happened to you? It was a time when you knew me. As your son. Because of you, we were a family again. I remember the sweet boy who made me laugh and gave me gifts. This city would have seen you dead. But I will have it your own. Brother, all of your scheming, the enemies that you have made every single day of your miserable life, what results did you expect? It's left me. You're turning your backs on you. Look at us now, Klaus. History taught you nothing. We don't abandon you. Nick, you drive us away. That your child will be born into a happy life? That the mother would be alive? To know her daughter? That we could live and thrive as some, as some sort of family? She deserves something better than what we had! It's you. You're the threat. Always and forever. Even though he locked you in a coffin for 90 years? Stored us in boxes. You were cruel. And controlling and manipulative. I was trying to protect you! Dagger all of you! Each for your own good! If you don't agree with my motives, fine. I never claimed to be the bastion of temperance, but stop this drivel about being singled out and unloved. And every soul wishes you are. We struck down. I held a beating heart in my head. Do you recall that? Yes. And yet here we are, still alive, still family. Who are a Michelson? You're my blood! I need you. To stand by my side. And I need you. I need you by my side. Be my brother. And by you, I will be your brother. Stand with me. Fall with him. Choose that son. You declared war when you came after my family. You can sacrifice the whole family. They will destroy everything you love. Even in a king. Caught by a one-time pawn. I'm almost impressed by the lengths you'd go to for your little girl. Will eradicate your malignant bloodline from this earth. But your daughter's around here somewhere, isn't she? Thus the game comes to its inevitable end. And at last, you will get the retribution you deserve. Always! Choose him. Nick was my family. If you were after him, you were after me. Brother, we fought every adversary in this town and we have won. We'll fight them again, no matter who they are. We'll make this home a fortress. If you come at him, you come at me. You've got to trust me for once in your life, and I will stand by your side, I promise. We'll protect each other, like we always have. When push comes to shove, you can always trust a Michelson to back another Michelson. That's what family does. We fight for each other. Well, who fight for you? Who you fight for? I've come from that blood. A family united. That is how we will face all our enemies. Together. As a family. We fight for those who will come to the enemy of our demons. Save our family. I know what you are, you know. We were never weak, Nicholas. 
Strongest in the world. Yes, you know, I've never seen anyone successfully stand against you. You are a wicked father. Not one of the countless devoted to your destruction. Strong enough to keep all of the bad things away. You will protect our home. Even in the face of an adversary such as our mother, because that brother. Whatever it takes. There is nothing I won't do to keep our daughter safe. I wasn't born like this, but I did not make myself this way. What have I become? It's an abomination. It's Michael who ruined me. Those of us that matter accept you for what you are. He was complicated and flawed and blind. Indeed, you should prevent the redemption. The cruel, the wicked, the vindictive Niklaus Michelson. Listen about Nick. He is a monster. Do not ever cross him. But he does want more from life than to just be feared. He's too broken to find it himself. But I do believe there is hope for him. And the baby that you carry. I think it's a girl. Yet each time that I am tempted to surrender, I see it. The glimmer of goodness. I'll stop searching for his redemption when I believe there is none left to be found. Maybe somewhere deep down, he still is the brother we once knew. All this child offer me. This child could offer you the one thing that you've never believed you had. And what's that? Conditional love. Conditional love of family. Will it guarantee me power? So is that all this child means to you? A grab for power. What does it mean to you? This was our family's hope. First, the promise of an offspring meant little to me. That child you carry is the only thing on this earth that matters to me. And I recalled my father, how he held me in contempt from the moment I was born. What do you call him that? He's not your real dad. Klaus will destroy it one way or another. He's done damage only your father could do. Your father didn't love you, so you assume that no one else will either. He's still in there. I believe that this baby means something to you. I want to believe in you. Don't let us down. My littlest wolf, I will do right by you. What's her name? Well, when Elijah thought you were dead, he said we lost our family's only hope. You gave her her name. Her name is Hope. Hope Michelson. Hope. Andrea Michelson. Those moments of joy in your life, however fleeting, have been simple pleasures. You believe there was a light in me. Light in you? It could be a light for my daughter. Uh, all of that anger, the cycle of abuse that Michael began, you can end it. You used to believe that you were the key to my brother's redemption. I loved him like a son. And survivors need names. How about Marcellus? There's hope for our brother after all. I failed you. To my eternal shame. You didn't fail me. You raised me. You taught me everything that I know. Quiet days teaching that boy Shakespeare. We taught Marcel to read with this very copy. You have that now too, don't you? The truth is, Klaus, I never thought I'd let you see this day. Someone you love more than anything, even yourself. One you would rather die than allow to be harmed. Redemption. He's never going to change. Not even for his own daughter. I don't think I can survive my own love for my daughter. I have brought into the world a weapon they can use against me. I do trust you. More than you know. I don't know what to do. And I really wish that you were here to tell me. Little wolf. I know your history. What she does know is that you protect your family. No matter what. It's okay to care. It's okay to want something. Nothing is going to harm my little girl. Nothing will even get close. I'm not going to let anything take you. I promise you that. I'm going to keep you safe. Always. And forever. You're all that matters to me. All Elijah was trying to do, all he's ever wanted for you. So what am I to you, Klaus? And you, Marcel. Will always be my family. Oh, you are okay. She has changed him. So you can be the one 
for you, little girl. Father protecting his daughter, I'd say that's exactly right. In fact, you help me believe in something your uncle once said. Family is power, Nick Klaus. Family is power. Family is power. She is the very best of me. Now she is everything, Nick Klaus, worth every fight, worth every sacrifice. It's destroying hope from the inside out. So how do we stop it? There's nothing we can do. She's my daughter. And without you, he wouldn't even be making the sacrifice. I can't allow my daughter to die. Do you understand you've accomplished in 15 years what I could in a thousand? Before you were born, I was a very different creature. I've not lived an honorable life. But hope, from the moment I saw you, I wanted nothing more than to be worthy of being your father. What kind of father allows another man to die for his child? The kind that loves her. I love you. Hope. If I love you, I love you. I love you too. Off my life, my onward wrenching desire has always been your redemption. I loved Nicholas. And he would have let the world burn just to save the people he loved. What is it that you intend to do, brother? Whatever it takes to save our family. You came for my child! My daughter! It's not the end of the Michaels. And you protect family. Like you and Mom and Mike protect us, right? Always and forever. Stick together as one. Always and forever. Always. Forever. Always and 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 forever, brother. Till forever ends. You are being a good father. And you are being a good person. You truly believe I am redeemed. I'm gonna make you proud. I'm so proud of you. My daughter, my heir. You're my heart. Finally living up to the potential that Cammy saw in you. I love you. I love you too. She would have been proud. Yes, I do.